not private schools, public schools. So what has From happened here school. in MS50? I am the mother of a middle school child. My daughter is 13 years old. I know for a fact, and she's lucky, and I'm not saying, it's to, in terms of middle and charter schools, my daughter goes to beginning with children. It is, it began as a public school, it is now a charter school, but it is a charter school that was driven by the community. It is driven by the community, it's led by the community. When we were looking for a middle school, they have a middle school, we realized, as you all realized, that we don't have good middle schools here for our children and options. Middle school 50, the potential to be an A school. It has the potential to be an A school. And what we are saying is that middle school 50 needs to continue. But what happened was is that we were informed in October, November, that some changes, November, Tessa saying November, that some changes were gonna happen in the community that some of the schools were going to be phased out, closed out, and that other schools were coming in. Nobody was asked from the community. No organizations were asked about what they felt was needed in the community. We started to hear something about middle school 50. And what we found out in December was that middle school 50 was going to house another school. This school is going to be a charter school. A charter school that's going to serve K through four. Kindergarten through fourth grade. We don't need another grammar school. We have PS19, PS84, PS17, PS16. Why? First of all, would they want to put another grammar school here in the middle of Los Sures when you have four elementary schools that we all know need support and that our children are going to and that they say has lots of seats, lots of seats that are open. 4,000 4, seats open in four schools and they want to put here in this building another elementary school, but not any elementary school, a charter school, not any charter school, Success Charter School. Yep. And why? A Success Charter School, and we know, because now we started to say Success Charter School. What is a success? What's Success Charter School? The Eva School. It's the Eva Moskowitz School. It is a school that now she has, I think, 11 schools in New York City. These are schools that are supported by big, Big, big money. These are schools that are not community schools. These are schools that are not about our young people and supporting them in communities like ours, like the, you know, African American. No, they say that. They are about something else. The money. Why would I say the money? What's that got to do with schools? What? Look, what's happening here in Williamsburg. There are lots of condos and developments going up. We all know we can't live here. We can't buy here. We can't rent here. But what the mayor and his vision not only for Williamsburg, for all of New York City, is that communities like ours will be phased out. Phased out. Another community is coming.
coming in. And why do people move into neighborhoods? If you have a family, the first thing you look at is your schools. Are there good schools? Are there schools where I'm going to send my kids? Well, that's what's behind this. What's behind this is that all of our schools, 50, 19, 84, 17, 16, 71, 126, we can keep going down the line. All of our schools are on the list to be phased out, closed out, or co-located with other schools, not public schools, maybe some public schools, but more often it's going to be charter schools in public school buildings. That is what's going on here. And before we know it, if we do not say no, it stops here. Each one of our schools, 50, 19, 84, 17, 16, 126 we already know. I have 71 we already know. Will change and become schools that will not serve our community, but will serve another community. And why do we know that? Because Eva Moskowitz for the last four months has been advertising for the school that's going to be here. Mira, in Rojosures? Have you seen anything? No. You see any big billboards? No. You see anybody coming and talking to that school? It's all been on the north side. Go to North 7th and Bedford. And you see big billboards. You see she's been having meetings. And my, I, will say for you, I will say it right here. We're not about dividing people against people. But what is just and what is fair, we have to stand for. If that's the community she wants, then that's the community the school should be in. The success school should be in the north side. like the success. 
successful. So now, tonight, you need to know people are looking at us and they're saying, whoa, I think we can all do this. We can say to the mayor, yeah. with his billions of dollars and his input, <laughs> no, we will not let it happen here. It stops here and other communities will come and say the same thing. No, it's enough. Department of Education needs to support our public schools. They need to support MS-50. No success school here but MS-50. Yeah. No. Next Thursday, 16th. Oh, two events. The two events. Two events. Thursday, we are getting buses together to go down to a meeting at Brooklyn Tech, where they're going to make a decision on PS19. Whether PS19 is phased out and a new school comes in. We are going to join with communities all around uh, New York City. 25 schools are going to go through a closeout. 33. 33 schools are going to go through a closeout in New York City. We are going to say on Thursday, no, PS19 does not get closed out. We want you to put money in PS19. We, the community, will support come up with an educational plan to make it an A school. Thursday, we'll have buses and you'll get information later. Next Thursday, the 16th, very important, public hearing here in middle school fifth. Six o'clock. The community gets an opportunity to say what they need to say. Show that we as a community will say no to the Eva Moskowitz Success School being co-located here, and yes to resources and, and money being put into MS-50 to make it an A, A plus middle school. Next week, it's very important. Three weeks ago, we had a meeting here. They didn't expect it, but we had hundreds of people out. Hundreds, and all of a sudden they said, oh, well, this is not the hearing. We're going to do another hearing. <laughs> okay? So next Thursday, we should have even more hundreds of people coming out That's to right. say no to the
Thank you.